Greetings World Walkers, Fayot here and in this vid we're gonna fight the Bloat King solo on Veteran. No heal needed. So I'm gonna show you the strat, it's very straightforward. The Bloat King itself, the pulsating mass that you see there, is not what you want to directly damage. What you want to do is break these encased spheres that will occasionally get out of its body and damage it as much as possible. The entire mass of this blob, of this floating orb of light, is a crit spot. Now when it returns to the mass, it will produce a sound that sounds like a chime. And the moment you hear that chime, you have to dodge. Wait for half a second and then dodge. You'll do this two times and the third time it will be a continuous beam as you see here. You just run to the side and you will avoid it no problem. As you damage the Bloat King, he will start producing more than one encased orbs. One of them is a dummy, does not contain the actual orb, and the other one is the orb you want to damage. The orbs it fires, the floating orbs that come towards you to damage you, are little explosives but can be detonated beforehand to avoid having to dodge them. It's the same rotation until the boss is dead. The light orb is unleashed, you damage it as much as possible, it returns to the mass, and then you have to dodge two of these lightning attacks and the continuous beam. If you have the engineer unlocked, just placing your turret when the orb is out, exposed, will do all the DPS for you if you just want to focus on dodging. If not, you have to damage it as fast as possible. Optimal DPS means that the boss will die faster and you don't have to fight a war of attrition. What was interesting about this one is that it doesn't really evolve its playstyle. Like from beginning to end, it's the same exact boss fight, with the exception of it producing two orbs instead of just one. There you can see me, I killed the dummy one, so I'm 100% sure that this one that I'm shooting right now is the actual boss sphere. I placed down my turret, hit it with the gunslinger attack, couple more bullets and it's gone. Sub like and share, hit the notification bell, I'm covering everything in Remnant 2. Until next time, be well, stay frosty, and always strive for perfection. Cheers!